Hey friends, today is Sunday here in Washington. It's a beautiful Sunday. Look at that. It's look at the sun. It's almost three o'clock in the afternoon in here and I got an invitation from our neighbor. They have three cherry trees in front of their house, so that's where I'm going right now. So if you want to see this um cherry picking adventure with me, then keep on watching. Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Raleen and you are watching Life in Washington State. So like I've said, I'm gonna go have some cherry picking with um, Nick. Uh, he's a friend of my husband, so by extension, I am now his friend too. So he invited me to join him, pick some cherry trees. I mean cherry, <laughs> cherry trees, <laughs> cherry, cherries. Okay, so yawn. So we're going there and i'm glad you're coming with me so let's look at the dog ari hello puppy what is it do you want to come with me puppy you want to come here i want to go now puppy i'm so sorry ari i cannot oh, oh my god ari what is it speak ari do you want to come with me no, 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 puppy! You're not coming with me, Ari. Bye, Ari! Hello. See, <laughs> see, I don't like... <laughs> That's Nick, guys, the owner of these cherry trees. Right here. Hello, Howdy. Nick. Thank you for the invitation. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> Look at that, guys! Oh, my God! So, that tree there is a bean cherry tree. Ah, so... Um, beans are dark and red big cherries oh i see and then this one right here this one here is actually called a cherry bomb cherry it has bomb. three different varieties of cherries grafted into one tree huh really yes so this here is bing it's a bing cherry okay very dark in color mm -hmm. and when you really dark and juicy oh yeah very yummy okay so they combined um the bing and uh, the bing and the you got bing and the bomb. rainier a oh, rainier the red one the yeah the light colored ones are rainiers and i don't remember what the third cherry is mm -hmm. that they grafted but what they do in the nurseries is they'll take the main tree which was a uh, rainier tree okay. and they grafted a branch into the uh, from a bing tree and from a different cherry tree grafted it into the tree mm -hmm. and that's how you get the three trees all in one oh, nice. and the reasoning for that is a cherry has to have at least two different varieties of cherries to cross pollinate if oh. you only have one chair one type of cherry you will not get any cherries you gotta have oh. at least three different types to cross pollinate. The bees can pro cross pollinate Amazing. to produce the fruit. <laughs> wow, this is this is new to me. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have cherry trees in the Philippines because I think this will only grow in um, colder climate. Uh, I'm not sure exactly uh, what kind of climate they prefer, but obviously they're doing really good here in washington yes my gosh nick uh, this is actually the most fruit i have gotten off of these two trees um since i've had them i want to say 15 years now mm. so aside from eating it raw nick i mean do you have any like is there a like a recipe for cherry trees uh there's or, cherry pie oh okay cherry um, pie there's a lot of things you can do with cherries. <laughs> I just, uh, uh, you me guys, personally, yeah. I just like to eat them uh, right off the tree or in a cherry pie. Mm. Um, some people, I think, believe, uh, I believe some people make jams out of them. Oh, I jam. don't know the whole process on that, but 
Yeah. Oh, see? <laughs> see, guys? So, in the Philippines, we only have manchinitas. <laughs> Here, we are upgraded now. We have cherries. Try the bean. So, this is the bean cherry cherries. So, they're big, as explained by Nick earlier. So, mm -hmm. let me try this. Mmm. It's so juicy. Mm -hmm. I love it. Um, mm, yummy. Actually, Nick, in the Philippines, we don't get fresh cherries. We only have it in can. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So, this is a nice experience for me. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're welcome. My gosh. Oh, my God. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> that happens. Thank you, Nick. So, try one of these Rainiers. Uh, Rainier. And compare the two. Okay, I'll reserve this one. So, Rainier, even if in this color, they're already ready. Yes. Mm. Oh, yes. Okay. And one thing you want to look for is little pinholes in the cherry. Because? Um, because they they'll have some worms bugs ah, okay because uh, i didn't spray these this year so there will i have found some bugs these ones look good that one um i would probably discard discard this that. yes ah, go ahead okay. and just toss that okay and uh that Let's one looks like one. it would be a good one. Oh yeah so so note Take note guys, these are organic cherries. So this is very good for our body. Hmm. It's a different taste, isn't it? This one has like a um darker taste. And this one has a lighter taste and it's yummy. Mm -hmm. It's yummy. But this one is I think it's more juice I mean it's juicier. Yeah. Hmm. Let's compare the seeds. This is the seed of the bin. And this is the rainier. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Almost the same. Yeah. Very much the same. Amazing. Where did you buy this night? I bought these trees at Walmart, actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this one is overripe already yeah so that one's no good no good oh my gosh this one is super big this one that looks good yeah yeah mm. Mm. i think you can also make a wine out of this I what do you think you could probably yeah Mm. If I would choose, let me try again right here. So I can, <laughs> <laughs> Let's go over over this way. Let's go over to these ones. Right here. This one. Mm. Oh. Here. Hmm. I think if I would choose, I'll choose a rain rainier. How about you? A lot of people like the rainiers. Yeah. Um, I like the bings a little bit better. But the bing, it's juicier. Mm hmm But this one is, uh, I like that um, it's lighter in taste and um, it's sweeter because maybe because of the dark taste of the bing, it's it tastes like wine to me, you mm -hmm. know? But this one, good. Hmm. Nice. So in one cherry tree, but three different kind of cherries. Three different cherries, yeah. yeah three different cherries. And they a lot of people refer to the that type of tree as a, a cherry bomb. Cherry bomb. Mmm. Nice. They're great for like um 
small yards that can't really handle too many trees. Um, Cause again, this one here will pollinate itself basically. You don't have to have three different planted trees to get fruit off of this one tree. Yeah, amazing. Um, how about the price um, difference? How much oh. if you buy like a one, just the bang and not the grafted, is, is there a big difference? Not to my recollection, recollect, <laughs> not to my remembrance. I don't remember how much yeah, one tree it costs. Been 10 years. <laughs> it's been a while, yeah. I agree. Wow, very nice. Okay, so you had a 3D printer? Yes. And you made this? I printed the mm. this piece right here. Nice. Very nice. And I was just trying it out, and it works pretty good. Hmm. Okay. Let's harvest some cherries. <laughs> but they still yeah. produce real i mean good amount of fruit yeah they're pretty low maintenance i'll trim them i'll prune them every every other year mm -hmm. um try and keep the height down a little bit and i haven't done it in a couple years but um yeah yeah they're pretty much low maintenance don't need to spray these ones because bugs they they produce kind of early so the bugs aren't and when they flower my <laughs> gosh what a lovely sight yeah and <laughs> what was it february or march they it, bloomed yeah and actually nick in the philippines like people will fly to japan or korea just to see cherry blossoms oh yeah <laughs> got a three that's so pretty So these are the cherries that I just picked, guys. Um, so thank you again to Nick and Melissa for allowing me to have these yummy cherries. I will have a juice tomorrow and I'm gonna include cherries. So that's it, guys. I hope you like this video. Um, if you do, please give me a thumbs up and share this to your friends. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I really, really appreciate it and I hope to see you next time and bye for now.